Christmas is coming, and you know what that means. It's the season of lies. Yeah, being dishonest may be the biggest tradition we have surrounding this holiday. We lie to children this time of year more than any other time. We lie about someone having a list of who's naughty and who's nice. We lie when we say Santa is watching over you, even when you're sleeping. We lie when we tell children that if they send a personal message to Santa, like with a letter, that he'll pay attention to it. Santa doesn't get the letters. We lie when we say everyone believes in Santa. They don't. We lie when we say he'll reward you if you've done good things. We lie when we say he'll punish you if you've been bad. We lie when we say Santa has these magical powers that no one else has. We lie when we say he'll come and visit you, and if you just believe, or if you stay up really late, then you get to see him too. We lie when we say Santa is everywhere. He is at every mall in America, simultaneously. <laughs> Amazing. We lie when we say Santa can defy the laws of physics by visiting every home in the span of a single night, or that he's going to grant everybody's wishes. We lie when we say we know where Santa lives. I mean, yeah, just trust us. He's at the North Pole. Y you can't visit him, but just take our word for it. We lie when we pretend Santa cares about our material gifts for him, as if he needs cookies and milk from everybody. We lie when we act like Christmas isn't also about money as much as it is anything else. I mean, we spend it, business owners want it, and they'll say pretty much whatever they have to say to get it. We lie when we say Christmas is about generosity, but then don't do anything to actually confirm that. You don't get to say Christmas is about giving and then not give money to charity or, or donate the items you don't need anymore. The truth is, we only talk about Santa because it's tradition. And it's tradition that's been passed down and altered generation after generation. And maybe this time of year is comforting, and it brings you joy, and you love the music and the atmosphere. And there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, as long as you can acknowledge that the Santa part of the holiday isn't real, then by all means, have at it. it it's a lot of fun. I'm going to celebrate it, too. But let's admit, the whole Santa thing is not something adults should take seriously. What's funny, though, is that a lot of adults believe the lies, even when they should know better. They just end up replacing the name Santa with God. My name is Hemant Mehta, and I write at FriendlyAtheist.com. What do you want to see a video about? Let us know in the comments below, and we'll be sure to check them out. And don't forget to subscribe.